Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Scum. My name is Blonde Don, and thank you guys so much for being here as usual. I always appreciate it. Um, today, I've got a couple plans. Um, kind of some fun plans, actually, I think. Um, the first one, it's going to be quick and easy. What I was thinking is that this, this twig base, it's not doing it for me right now. And I don't think it's going to take a whole lot to actually upgrade. So let's actually check that here really quick. Okay, so that's going to take uh, 10 boards, 5 logs, and some chopping with my axe. So that's actually, I mean, it's quite a bit of logs, but I, <laughs> but I think it'll actually be pretty quick and easy to get this done. And then the second thing that I wanted to do today... Oh, there's an airdrop right here. Um, okay, well, I guess the second thing I want to do is get that airdrop. But then the third thing is I want to head all the way up to this place right up here. Now, I've never been to this city, and this city is absolutely massive, and I can only assume it's extremely dangerous. So, I really don't know what to expect. Um, I don't know how much medical supplies I should bring. I don't know if I'm gonna get overwhelmed with puppets. I, I, I really don't know what to expect at this point, but I'm just gonna go, we're just gonna explore, we're gonna do a bunch of looting, and uh, hopefully we come out ahead. Um, <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. And then, now that I think about it, since we're gonna be up here, we might as well head up to this trader. I haven't been to a trader yet. I keep talking about it. So I'm thinking we take the loot from here and we head over to a trader and maybe we can see, see if anything that we have is worth anything. If it is, that's great. If it's not, whatever. But I, I'm just super curious to see what the whole trader world is like. And, and I guess that's gonna be the first time that we end up back in the snow area. Uh, since we started so um let's get started here actually this airdrop is right behind us so <laughs> let me go grab this really quick um oh yeah and really quick i did obviously if you saw last episode we were all the way down here we did a ton of looting it was a ton of fun it was absolutely crazy um i transferred the vast majority of the loot over to the base here and i'll go over that here once we once we get back to the base but i want to do some lock picking here do i even have what I need for that on me. Okay, I've got some safety pins, got some advanced lock picks. Okay, I, th I think we'll be fine. Oh, an SVD. Um, if I remember right, we've actually got some things for the SVD. Um, I might have actually left some at the, um, at the stash that we had at the... Uh, all the way across the map there, but we can always go back and get that stuff. Okay, well, uh, I guess that's everything. It wasn't wasn't all that great. Let's take the military backpack with us here. Let me. Uh, you guys, let me know. Actually, last episode that we can carry the backpack and throw things in the backpack. So that's what I'm actually going to do, just to bring this over to the base here, quick. Let's get this uh, unloaded here. I'm gonna already have to make another storage box. Yeah, we brought back an AK-15, the M1 rifle, um, some ammo, as well as uh, some attachments for different things. Um, I don't think I have any of the SVD attachments or anything like that, but that's okay. I'm not really interested in using the SVD, um, I, especially now that we've got the AWM. But that's what I wanted to talk about is the AWM. So last episode, I picked up an AWP and then I picked up the AWM without realizing it because I thought they were both the exact same gun. Um, and I was talking about how I only had AWM mags instead of AWP, uh, but essentially I had the right magazines the whole time. Um, the only thing that we're missing at this point for this gun is just a, a sight for it. Um, otherwise, this thing looks pretty cool. Um, hard to see like this, but I did put the uh, the weapon camo on it. I've got a silencer on it now. Yeah, like I said, all that's left is is just a sight for it. But we can get some ranged kills in like this. I think this I think this will do just fine for a while. 
Um, and then I'm gonna carry my UMP on me as well as my block. All right, guys, so this is pretty much all I've got on me is a bunch of ammo for the UMP, for the block, and a little bit more for the AWM. The AWM has already got a full magazine in it. Um, we've got another half here. Um, and then I do have a third magazine, but I don't even have enough ammo for it, so I'm just going to leave it. Um, I think for the most part, I think most kills that we're going to try and get are some silent kills, hopefully not setting off other puppets. And we're going to try and get some silent silence kills with the Block 21 because that's what we have the most ammo for. It just makes the most sense. All right, guys, so I'm dressed up in the ghillie suit because apparently I was still getting a little bit cold. I was getting a little bit of hypothermia. Um, so I figured I might as well take this time to warm up, uh, chop some trees down, and upgrade the base. Hopefully it doesn't take too long, but um, I guess let's get started. Look at that. Oh, that looks way better than the twig. Oh, this is going to look pretty cool. All right, I'm going to keep working, guys. Got her done. Let's check it out here. Okay, let's check out the outside really quick. That doesn't look too bad. It's definitely an upgrade. Definitely an upgrade in the in the looks department. Let's check out the inside here. Okay, not bad. Yeah, I feel a little bit more secure in here. I always felt kind of uh, vulnerable when it was just the twig foundation and walls and stuff. Uh, but I definitely feel safer in here. Um, I did not upgrade the ceiling and that's because I'm considering working upwards and honestly, it, I really don't notice the ceiling in the first place. Um, I'm always looking down anyway, so I didn't think it was that big of a deal. Plus, it was going to take me a lot longer. A couple issues that I ran into is that when I did upgrade the foundation, some things that were on the foundation that I was upgrading kind of got sucked into it and um, I couldn't get back out um, like this plank right here. It was a plank and then I think some rope somewhere in here too. I think it's underneath this uh, jacket, uh, but the rest of the things uh, ended up being fine. You can kind of see in the, in, the <laughs> in the fire here, it's a little bit sucked into the floor. I'll end up destroying that at some point. And same with this bed. I'm going to make an upgraded bed eventually as well um, to make the, the place look a little bit better. Um, but yeah, I think it looks pretty good. So I think uh, let's head out here. It looks like, uh, ooh, getting a little overcast here. Um, probably going to get some rain soon, but yeah, I think I'm going to head up northwest here and... Uh, I guess that's out this way. So I'm going to head up northwest here, and uh, I guess let's go check out that massive city. All right, guys, we're coming up on the outskirts of the big city right now, and of course it just got absurdly foggy, so it's impossible to see anything right now. I might actually just park right here, head into this building, and kind of just wait out this weather. So let's clear the building here really quick. All right, looks clear. I think I'm probably just going to hang out in here until this overcast kind of cloudy, uh, foggy weather goes away. It looks like the sun's starting to peek through, so I don't think it should be too long. So I'll see you guys in just a minute. All 
All right, guys. Took a little bit of a nap out here on the roof, but it looks like it's kind of clearing up. It's still foggy for sure, but it's a little bit easier to see with the sun out. So let's head down there and head into the town here. All right, I have no clue what to expect here. I don't know if I should just leave my bike out here because it's gonna it's gonna be really loud and bring in a lot of puppets potentially. And it's still, man, this, this fog, this mist is brutal right now. Well, how about this? Uh, I'm gonna get off right here. I'm gonna remember where I left my bike. Okay, pretty much right below the corner up here in the southern part of the city. What I want to do here is I want to check out these really big buildings. Maybe check out these small ones. I don't, I don't really expect a whole lot in these, but I don't want to bring my bike in too far right now. Okay, this is definitely more like industrial area. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that guy was military. This guy's still... Okay. I thought he was still moving. <laughs> we're good. We're good. Okay, anyone else? No, we're good. Okay. Let's search these guys. Oh, a cup of coffee. I mean, might as well. It's free. Okay, so those guys were military, so is this area actually more military? Oh boy. Okay, I got one right here. Okay, any more? Okay, that guy's down. That guy's down. Anyone else? Okay, I think we're good. Here, let's close this up. A box of bolts in here, and that's it. There's nothing to even search through. Tell you what guys i was already intimidated coming to the big city but this fog in the air makes it 10 times creepier okay we set off a few of them here Are they in here okay there are some in here i don't think they can get out here um do i have any melee weapons Ooh, that's one thing i forgot to bring maybe we throw the Axa on. <laughs> I can't. I can't hit him through this. I'm just gonna shoot her. Okay, what is this room? I think just a regular little office area. Yeah. All right, let's keep moving here. Now, the thing is, since I know nothing about this city, I don't know if there's buildings that. I should be looking for in particular that are going to have all the good loot or just go for anything. I really don't know. So far, it's just been some kind of office buildings and restaurants. What I'm going to do is I'm not going to spend... Uh, I'm not going to spend too much time looting what looks to be kind of regular buildings like the like like the office buildings and and like the bars and things like that but i guess i don't know what else that leaves around here i just know that i have to be really careful especially when i hear that sound i do not need to be setting off any uh, explosive puppets I have no clue where that one was at. What is this? Oh, it's a, it's a waterway. Okay. 
Part of me is terrified to go even near that laughing puppet. But the thing is, is I'm wondering if that's potentially in an area of some good loot. I'm curious why that puppet's there in the first place. Okay. It sounds... Hold on, there's a puppet nearby, but... It sounds like it's coming from that building. And that's exactly the type of building that looks like it's worth looting. Okay. It actually sounds like there's at least two of them. Here, let's, uh... <laughs> Let's throw the saw back into my inventory and let's put the, the UMP on. Now, if I remember right, the UMP is also silenced. Is that right? Oh, no, it is not. All right, guys. Um, I'm just going to push forward here. Okay, we got one right here. We got two of them. I'm going to just take them out. One down. Two down. Okay. Oh, how did you hear? How did you hear? Oh, that was a beeper. Oh, I hope that doesn't bring in a bunch of other ones. All right, here it goes. Here it goes. Oh. Okay, I'm going to give it a minute. Let's see if there's any more puppets that end up coming through. Okay, that didn't seem to attract any other ones. So I'm going to move forward. So that's one down. It sounded like there was two. I might have been wrong. But I'm not hearing... Okay, now there's at least two more. I hate their laugh, guys. I hate it. One of them stopped laughing. You might have heard me. Yep, 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 you heard me. I'm missing. Oh! I shot his jack. I must have shot the actual explosive. I did not. I did not know I could do that. That thing almost got close enough, too. Okay, let's, uh, let's check our ammo and let's move forward here. Okay, we got three shots with this. Here, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna duck under the stairs here quick. Find some cover. And then I'm gonna reload, make sure I've got some full mags. Okay, should be good. Let's keep moving. Let's get up here. I don't hear any more, uh, laughing. At least... For the time being. I have to be very careful. I don't know what this building is. The billboard says Tech One News. So is that what this is? Is a news building? Wait, no, that's not. Oh. Oh, but there's more, there's more, there's more. Where are you? Oh, this looks like there's good loot though. Oh! Oh no, gotta go, gotta go, guys. I just heard so many. I just heard a beep. Hold on, let's get at the stairs. They might have to come down the stairs. That was it, that was the, the one. Oh my gosh, I went loud on that. I don't know if I should have. I'm gonna get up here. This might be a huge mistake, we'll see. No, 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 no. Oh boy, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, thank goodness these guys can't climb. I just, oh, that, that was a huge mistake. Do you hear this? There's so many. I took all my UMP because I thought that I was going to face a horde of the, of the puppets and now I'm facing a horde of the puppets because I brought out the UMP. Okay, let's be careful with this. Um, I'm gonna use my my block 21. Um, oh my goodness! Look at these guys. Let's see if I can get some angles on them. 
Oh, this is difficult. I don't know if I can shoot through the floor. I don't... Go, 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 go. That thing's gonna blow up on me. Oh, I hope this is high enough. Oh, I hope this is high enough. Okay, hopefully, hopefully we survive this. Hopefully we survive this and it, it, it blows up the rest of them. Or at least a good chunk of them. I don't know if he's gonna blow up. This is my nightmare, you guys. Did you hear that? That was the first time I- <gasps> That was so creepy. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but that was the first time I've ever heard any of these puppets speak. If you heard that, he said, help me. I think he said it twice, but he definitely said, help me. Oh my gosh. That makes it way too real. Knowing that there's like still human in some of these. Oh, and the way he said it too. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I hope I don't regret this. Um, okay, so it sounds like there's a lot less down here. Some of these even forgot I was here. I'm gonna still take them out, but I think that that exploding one did a lot of damage, so that's good. All right, two down. Um, let me. I'm gonna try and get down a little bit here and see if I can get a better angle at these guys. That guy made it easy. <laughs> I think we might be okay. Well, here, let's um, let's take this opportunity to use this thing. Oh, I missed. That time I didn't. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, I think we're good to go down, so I'm going to go and give it a shot. There's so many bodies down here. Okay, let's keep moving. I still hear a laughing one out here. I don't know where this guy is. He must have been under the bleachers or something. I don't know if I can draw him out. Oh, is this him? That was him. Beautiful. Okay, I heard another one, but... Or another just regular puppet. I'm gonna let this one go off. How many are there? Okay, let's hope that that was the actual last beeper. I don't hear any. But we're only on this side of the... of the court. I'm gonna see if I can see anything under the bleachers here. Hear one on the other side of the wall. We might have to clear uh, the outside of the stadium as well. I think I'm gonna do that. I don't want to take any chances. Okay, after we clear the basketball court, we might move to this building. I don't know what this is. 
But it definitely doesn't look like a normal building. Like any residential or anything like that. Alright. There's another, uh, there's another beeper up here. Okay. I don't know where I should be aiming to to blow those things up right away, but I'm honestly okay with blowing them up in, in one shot as long as they're at the right distance. Now, I heard another one over here, so let's approach carefully. Okay, he's down there. I definitely don't have a shot at him. So I think, um, I think with him being down there, I think we're going to be okay. So let's go check out the stadium quick. There's so many. Oh, I think I set off the, the laughing one. Here, let's get a full mag just in case. This is either a really good spot or a really bad spot. I don't know. I think there's there's, there's the only two entrances that they uh, that they can come from. Okay, he's laughing right now, so that has to mean that he doesn't know where we're at. Okay, I think we're finally clear in here. So I'm gonna start looting. I'm gonna keep my head on a swivel, but I'm definitely gonna start looting and see if we can find anything good here. So guys, as I'm going through this right now, obviously there's a lot of these military crates, um, but there's also a lot of these wooden crates. And my assumption was that this was used as some kind of outpost when everything, uh, I guess, went down, when everything went wrong. Um, and obviously it did not last. Uh, I got a magazine here, okay. Um, but yeah, obviously, obviously it did not last long enough and eventually was taken over. Now here's another backpack. I might take this because it's a pretty cool backpack. Do we have room for it though? I don't want to fill up my own hands with it right now. Yeah, let's put stuff in it. I think we can put stuff in it. Then can we put it in our other bag? I don't think that's the case. No, um... There we go. Okay, I made a little bit of room in my bag. If I need to get rid of it, I will. But I don't want to be running around with my hands full with just another backpack. Because I know a lot of you guys actually let me know that um, I can carry a backpack with things in it, which will obviously allow me to, to increase um, the things that I, the, the amount of loot that I brought back. Um, but I just, I can't use that. I can't risk that in this scenario. I need to have a gun in my hands at all times. A fully loaded gun too, preferably. All right, guys, I think I've cleared out the whole uh, the whole basketball court. So I'm gonna keep moving. I think it was on this side of the building that um, there was that other building that we were gonna loot, but I guess I didn't loot the office area here. Oh, there is some boxes. I'm still gonna be quiet though, because I do not want to set off that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> let's get back. Um, let's get over this way. I'm bleeding. I don't know how bad. How bad is it? Um, okay, it's not bad. It's just a C1. We should be okay. And I'm now realizing I don't really have any meds on me at all. Thought I had... Okay, I do have an emergency bandage. I'm not going to use that right now because I definitely don't need it um, since we just have C1 injury. So uh, if I do need anything more serious, I'm absolutely going to use that. Oh, 
Okay, out of nowhere, I started hearing the laughing ones again while I was looting. I don't want to stick around. That, um... That last occurrence was a close enough call. I say we push towards this building and see if there's any good loot in this one. Okay, this looks like it's some kind of classroom. I don't know if that laughing is coming from inside this building or underneath us. Because I think there's a roadway that goes below us. I don't know where exactly, but... Oh, I got that drone on me right now. Now is not the time. I can hear a puppet in here. Oh gosh, that beeping. Oh, this, this school is so creepy. Completely abandoned halls. The mist rolling through here. I do not like it. Okay, well this was the art room it looks like. I don't know what kind of loot we can really expect out of a school. Except maybe some clothes out of these lockers. That's all I'm really seeing right now. I'm going to get up to the second floor and see what there is. If it doesn't seem like there's much in here, then, then we'll keep it moving. Looks like this floor is pretty clear. Um, there is a rooftop. I say we go up there. See if there's anything valuable. Um, I didn't check any of the rooms for loot. But I'll do that in a second. I just want to make sure we're all clear. Okay, this is a good spot to get a little overview. Okay, so there's the, the track. And the parking lot out there. Um, there's a massive apartment building up there. All right, what else do we got out here? Oh boy. I set some off. But I'm not too worried, honestly, because we're up here. They should not be able to get up here as far as I know. Okay, there is some here on the second floor here. I guess I only cleared the, the one side of the building. Okay, this is going to be tricky. I'm setting off every dang puppet in this building now. Okay, well, I'm going to go back to this ladder. I, I really don't think there's much. Let me see if there's... If I can get any view inside these rooms. They all look about the same. The only thing I can tell... That's in this building are some lockers. This looks like it might be some kind of storage room. I might check that out, though. Hold on, there's actually a ladder right here. Where does this go? Ooh, this goes down a level. Um, This looks safe. Mostly safe. Okay, let's go down this ladder. Okay, uh, it doesn't look like there's an entrance into the building outside of going back on the ground. I don't want to do that just yet, so I'm going to go back through that other ladder. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, you guys. How many are there? 
You hear him? He's saying, get it off. That's so creepy. I don't want them to blow up underneath me. I don't know if it could potentially go through the wall or the, the ceiling. There's more here. Are they in there? I need to be able to get a shot at them. Oh my goodness. Get away from me. Oh no. He specifically told me to get away from him. That's so dark. To me, that makes it sound like he doesn't want to kill me. Am I overthinking that? Oh, that's so crazy. You hear Ooh. Okay, well, one went down, and I don't seem to have gotten injured from that. There he goes. Okay. Okay, so we are safe up here. The explosion does not go through the ceiling. That's really good to know. There's more. They're everywhere. Guys, I, I, I'm trapped. I, there's another beeper down below me. And I hear... Oh my gosh. And I hear another one laughing out here somewhere. <laughs> Guys, I'm going to have to call it here. I need to come up with a plan. I need to figure out how to get out of here. I don't want to leave the city just yet, but I need to find a safer spot than where I'm at right now. I feel like I'm in a complete war zone. I'm, I'm surrounded by homing missiles right now. As soon as I make a noise near them, they come running after me and they will kill me. Guys, if, if you know any ideas, if you've got something for me, let me know. Please let me know. But I'm going to leave it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Later.